have to sell kids never do a reaction video midway through an episode and then stop for 10 months and go back because you're going to get all shades of confused. All right. So, you and that Kai and Vanessa are still alive, but not for long. Oh, Christ. Uh, that's right. The only other the character I hated more than... Well, I can't come up with a good pun for Weasley, so I'll get back to that later on that. Our powers combined. You suddenly want to work together. I know, I know. But how about we slay this overgrown sea slug, free our friends, help these Vikings, and then finish our argument? Feed on land! Stop it with the Dortlinger! <laughs> I'm still lost! How did the Viking sacker it to this? <coughs> Last I remember from this season... Something about a volcano? That's it. But there is a kind of a subplot I'm genuinely interested in is... There's something wrong with this game. Which... Okay, what's going on with that? And the... What's his name? The purple guy. Is like, dude, you're not supposed to be here. Like, what is going on with this? <laughs> but, um... Deal, but I'm not letting you off the hook. <laughs> Were they... Are they exes? Why do they have... Why are they talking to each other in almost like friendly banter? I thought they, oh, they were exes. They had one hell of a buttercream gang. That's for. <laughs> <laughs> Let me off the hook. It'd be me letting you off the hook. <gasps> horrible, horrible place to pause. I see you are eager to feast, ya. Yeah. Where is this going? Oh, you ran into my large ass. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ready to... F you ready to feast. <laughs> Christ. This show is full of unintentional hilarious moments. That are, uh, this is like the second unintentional pedophile I've seen. After that freaky doctor guy who dressed up the one character in a goddamn sailor suit. <laughs> ah. I'll admit I am having fun doing this, but I can't really say I'm a huge fan of the show. Huh? We have cured fish enough to go around. Yeah, thanks, but... We're more into each other than we are your large ass. <laughs> we have a proposal for you instead. We will defeat Tursus. <laughs> He's a nice toad, but my risky warriors have failed. Evil ones such as you have no hope against Tursus. You are brittle, weak, like bread made by Gorm. It's true, I make some very bad breads. You cannot possibly... Yes. Yeah, every now and then the show gets kind of lame, doesn't it? Yep. I don't even know. Somehow I'd be more embarrassed if my family walked in on me watching this instead of Big Mouth. At least they know I watch Big Mouth. This is just kind of... Okay, occasionally it's kind of a lame, but... It really isn't that bad. To offer anything that countless likes and heroes could not. Actually, we must. So, I think you're strong and yours have super speed, I think? Christ. <coughs> but at least I remember what happened last time on um, Kid Cosmic, so there's that. God, this show is so forgettable, at the, uh, top too, isn't it? Eee. God. And she was telling you to man up. 
No, no, I, I'm kidding. I like She-Ra too. That's another show I'm kind of, I'm kind of okay on. Like, I like, I know, I like She-Ra a lot better than this. The voice acting is a lot better. Nothing against the voice acting here, but it's just got a lot, it's a lot better in She-Ra. And the animation is so much better. Uh, but and there's a couple lame things in She-Ra too, I'll admit that. Did I even get very far with that? I, I got two episodes done, I think, and never finished the third. At least I remember what happened in that one episode. That's nothing. Five oh. Well then... Who was the speedster? Was that the blonde shaggy kid? Whatever the fuck his name was? Oh my god, I don't remember his name. Or your name. <coughs> I thought it was hilarious when that shaggy kid died. I thought that was hilarious. I'm not gonna lie. The snail killed him or something. That, or was it a slug? I don't give a shit. When he was killed, like, I... And they put the hat on the grave. Like, that's fucking funny to me. Um, yeah, it's not, I can't really say a lot for this show, it's, it's weird how I remember a lot from the first season, it's some parts of the second season, but it's just, this plot line with the Vikings is so forgettable. Let me what is he doing? Shove barrels up her ass. <laughs> oh. Oh. Not bad. Thank you. You know what the stud me of? And I, I probably brought it up in one of the other videos I did on this ten months ago. But it vaguely reminds me of The Eye of Minds, that James Dashner book. I only read the first book of that series, but I fucking loved it. Where it's like, it, you have, it's like a virtual reality world where they go through different worlds. That book was a lot better than this show is, but, I don't know. I don't hate this show. I want to make that fully clear. I really don't hate the show at all. It's just not really my... I don't know. I thought, like, the trailer looked kind of cool, but... And the first episode was kind of cool, but after that, it kind of... Meh. Probably could stop there.